Bikes, hello. Uh, quick video, SG106. Um, before I actually go out into the field, which I can't do yet because it's still too windy, um, I've had a couple of I've had a couple of uh, messages of complaint about this. Apparently, it's a 1080p camera. So it says 1080p camera, wide angle, it says 1080p camera on a couple of spots, however some people have been saying it's not actually 1080p so I'm just going to have a quick shoot outside and do a video test which actually show you exactly what this uh, camera puts out. We'll say it's not 1080. It says HD camera on there, so let's see exactly what it is. Wondering if it's not 1080, we'll soon find out anyway. Cue the editing. Okay, so there's a little bit of wind there. We're going to hit the record button. Uh, as far as I'm aware, we are on uh, the best recording possible. So we are now recording, as we can see on the screen. Just make sure my screen's recording, and we're going to see exactly uh, what the resolution is of videos and photos. So let's get cracking. So make sure we're set on three. One and two of this drone don't work very well for some reason. So okay. Still recording, and yeah, let's go. See the camera up there. So the optical uh, positioning hold doesn't work very well either on this drone. You can see it's moving sort of by itself. So just go up and take a quick. Video of some greenery, maybe a bit of blue up here. Trying to keep it steady for you guys. Okay, and hopefully, this is recording 1080p. Take a couple of photos. I believe I can take a photo while I'm recording the video. If not, I shall stop the video briefly, take a couple of photos. I don't know if you guys can see that, but the, um, yeah, the wind is tending to move it around a little bit. It's not actually all that windy here. Take another quick photo if we can. Okay. And let's get the video rolling again. Just to be double certain. Of course, I haven't done the battery test of this yet. I haven't had a chance to get out. The weather hasn't been all that good. Just looking for a nice, calm day to fly it. I don't know if you guys can see that, but it's um, yeah, it's going backwards and forwards quite a lot. And as mentioned on this before, there is no trimming available with this drone, so um, you've just got to rely on the calibrating at the start to do the job, unfortunately, which it doesn't often do. So let's get a little bit of height and see if we can uh, keep it nice and steady for us. Okay. I will do some better tests on this later on, but at the moment I just really want to see if this is recording in 1080p. Just to answer you, the questions you guys have been asking. Okay. Not too sure if that's going to take a photo, but you can see, you can see by the way it's behaving, it's just doing its own thing. I shall bring it down before I lose it. I've got plenty of video footage now. You can see number three is quite skitty and fast. Let's try and Put it in front of us so it just sits there. And just switch the stay there, stay there, no, okay. Stay there, and switch the videos around. So that we have an underside shot at the same time, which you can't do while you're recording. So let's take another quick photo. 
do some uh, picture adjusting. Yeah, it really does wander by itself, this drone. Just sit still, will you? It's quite frustrating, actually. I must admit, if I'm honest. I'll stick it on number one, see if that slows it down a bit. Okay, so I'm not holding on to it there. You can see it's, mm, it's really doing its own thing. And also number one isn't very responsive with the sticks either. It's quite, quite dull and doughy. So I'm not touching anything there. And um, you can see it's... Oh, now it's landing by itself. Look at that. Ooh, it's coming over to me. Hello. <laughs> Who knows what it's doing. It really doesn't like the wind destroying guys. It really doesn't like it. Okay. I'm going back up to number three because that gives me the most response from my sticks. Some underneath footage going. Okay, so we've got Ford and underneath now. Don't know if we can record this. Can we record this footage? Yes, we can. So I'll just oh, stand still. Let's do a quick record of the forward and underside camera. I'm not actually um, doing this on purpose, guys. It is really quite a twitchy little unit, this 106. Quickly just head up a bit. Oh, no, 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 it's going off by itself. It just will not sit still. I suggest the optical camera underneath isn't all that good. You can see it there, it's just going all over the place. Man. Okay. I was hoping this would be a bit better than this, but there you have it. A quick test of the 106's um, oh, video capabilities. Hopefully I got up on the screen the actual size of this. Just gonna, it's just going to keep on going by itself until something happens. See ya. Bye bye. Okay, time to land. Alright. Oh, look at that. She's just crashed. Alright, there you go guys. That's what eventually happens to your 106. It eventually just goes that crazy it just lands by itself and then there's some sort of alarm so there you have it folks here yeah. yeah, drop me a comment if you know anything about this how i can fix this but this is a very difficult drone to fly i'll do a battery test next so stay tuned smash that thumbs yeah drop us a comment Otherwise, um, yeah, I hope you've got, uh, got some good info from this uh, video about the actual 1080p or not 1080p of the SG-106. <laughs> See you in the sky.